And so begins my senior trip. Georgie's not coming with us. We're going to drop her off at Grandma's house. But it's just me, my mom and dad, and we're Busted. about to leave. About seven hours. So road trip time. We only, we've only been driving for like an hour and 15 minutes, so we still have quite a while to go. But snacks though. Yeah, but snacks though. Also, uh, wanted to shout out this little, little pouch right here. Don't um, eat it. Don't do it. My parents don't like you it, but I, it. I love it. It's called, um, it's like Chia food. Squeeze by Mama Chia. What is it like, Mom? It's like baby food. Well, they hate it, but it has like. <laughs> Dad says it's like a cactus. <laughs> But it's like these little chia seeds in them, and it has like this really cool texture. Well, no, try like. our snack. Our snack is really yummy. Turn left. Like this is it's actually right. good. Like it tastes good. It's just cheese, but baked cheese. But oh, like not like vegan baked though. Baked cheese. No, not vegan. Not but, vegan. But good though. So all you all you um dairy eaters, try that mm -hmm. stuff out. <laughs> I stopped at a rest area, and I thought I would just show you guys the view we have right now. We're in Maryland, and the view is like pretty cool. So. I'm going to eat some chipotle. Like, ew, I have a fat neck. Oh, shut up, that's all you ever say. I have I a fat like I have a fat neck. <laughs> right, I just didn't want to do that until I had to in this bus. That street's really cute. That's where we went, yeah. Then one of them says, like, joy or something. We have to go back and. Dude, Harrisburg, PA is probably the cutest place I've ever been, ever. We're about to go into our Airbnb and I'm literally so excited to see what it looks like because like it's literally so cute here. I cannot even like seriously. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness oh my gosh i cannot this is so i li I, I, I can't okay i'm about to go upstairs oh my gosh dude this is so cool I think the light's broken in this room, but it's like a little room with a couch. So there's like three bedrooms up here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, there's a back porch. Oh my gosh. Look. Oh Look at that. my. I literally, I don't even know what to say. This is just so cute. Look, there's our bus. JJ would love this, wouldn't he? People, people, city, city. <laughs> it's a spider. Ew, look, can you kill that? Hey, can you kill that spider over there? I mean, look at the Does walls. Does this apartment belong to? They're decorated with like yeah. movies. They're signs. They're signs. Look, this one is signed by Oliver Stone. That's crazy. I told her, I said, he's not gonna let you have this room because the AC. Yeah, I know. It's a ticket to the inaugural, inaugural wall. Look. That's huge. Dude, they have a lot of stuff. And to the inauguration? That's awesome. Don't put me in there. Bye. We're literally right on the street in this cute little town. They even have little snacks for us, right like here. seaweed. It says enjoy your stay. Oh, we have to sign this when we're done. Mm -hmm. People who own this house left some gluten-free vegan snacks for me. I'm gonna try seaweed for the first time. I've never tried this. So we're gonna see how this actually tastes. Cause I've seen people try it, but I've never tried it. What the heck? People actually eat this? I'm scared. Is this out of date? What if this is out of date or something? 
can see we'd be out of date. I'm scared. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm really scared to eat this, but I'm just gonna do it. Oh my gosh. I don't know what to think of this. Is seaweed even vegan? I don't even know if seaweed is vegan. I mean, what would be in it that's not vegan? I don't. I don't like it. It's just a little bit salty and fish tasting. One bar. I've never had this. It's gluten free and vegan, so. Mmm, this is really good. It tastes like an apple. This is really good. I'm a little bit concerned because I was reading the seaweed paper and it says consuming this product can expose you to chemicals including lead, arsenic, some other words I don't know, which are known to the state of California to cause cancer and cause birth defects. Hmm. I'm gonna throw this stuff away now. No. And party. Isn't it crazy? Like this is so much and you can just like scan through Google and it's like a cheat. It's coming apart, it's so. I mean, right now we're basically in like a museum. Like this house is li literally a museum. Like everywhere you go in this house, like any room, there's like so much. Like, wow. We get some coffee. And then we're going to church with our friend from Virginia who lives here, so. <laughs> Ready for the coffee. Mm -hmm. We got our coffee. Mom hates her coffee. She thinks it's, uh, it's disgusting. This is like Maxwell House, like Bulger's Gross, like burned Starbucks. I bow. like mine. Just act casual. 65. Sheet music. And these old magazines. We are back in our Airbnb house. Earlier this morning, we went to church with some of our good friends from Virginia Beach who now live in Harrisburg. While we were at church, something kind of unexpected happened, I guess. Really just in the moment kind of thing. Not something obviously I could record or anything, but um, I came to a realization that I really, I mean, lately I haven't really been on the right path, you could say. I took the time to talk to actually the pastor there because it was crazy. The whole sermon this morning was just completely written for me like I swear by it he completely wrote that for me there's obviously the Holy Spirit moving in all of it and it was just crazy how it related to my whole entire situation right now I've just been on the wrong path and I know I need to get right and I had to start by confessing you know and just being honest and genuine humbling myself and taking away all the pride and I did have a talk with um, the guy who spoke this morning and he prayed with me. And it was just honestly such a moving moment. I just wanted to add that in here because I want my vlogs and my videos to just be completely genuine and honest and real. Yeah, I am having a lot of fun and I'm exploring and having a great trip, but also, I mean, this is like, things like this do happen too and it's like a real thing and it's really, real for me and it's something that I thought I should share with you guys. I've honestly really been struggling and this morning just I kind of broke 
I, I got very emotional. And honestly, so amazing to see, I guess, God move in the whole situation. I just feel honestly so much better, and I wanted to share it with you guys as like a testimony just to show you that it's okay. I mean, we, we get off track sometimes, we really do. God's not going to love us any less. He's going to forgive us, and we can't break ourselves down for things. Um, we're going to mess up. We're, we are definitely going to mess up. I've messed up. But you have to focus on God's love for us instead of the sin itself. And you have to be open and honest. And you have to talk about it, you know. And that's what I've done. I've talked to my parents about it. And it just honestly helps so much. And it helps to have people to talk to. So just be open and honest and know that everyone gets off track. Sometimes it happens. You got to... You gotta take a step and start by making it right again. You can't keep saying, well, I need to get right, because you're never gonna get right if you just say that and don't take action towards it. Um, and that's what I'm trying to do right now, honestly, is I'm just trying to take action to get myself back on track again. And I thought I should share that with you because it was a very pivotal moment in today. Um, yeah. We're going to the world's the largest, not the world's. <laughs> what the heck? Dreaming, girl. We're going to the East Coast. Yeah, it's the largest mall on the East Coast. Um, wow, that was that was tricky. That was yeah. It's <laughs> King of Prussia, right? King of Prussia. <laughs> um, so every girl's dream, like the, one of the largest malls in the country. So let's head over there. Sorry, I haven't vlogged a lot, but dude, this mall is is so huge. Like it's never ending. Like there's so many stores I've never even heard of. It's crazy. Hope you all enjoyed the vlog. Um, I had a great time. I'm also glad to be home, like a, a little bit of both. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go eat some Cheerios right now. Subscribe and like.